A whistleblower under investigation sounding the alarm about the process of implementing Obamacare in the state of Washington. The judge's Patricia Peterson says the Insurance Commission pressured her to rule in favor of the agency in a case that would cut health care costs but limit choice. Now she is being investigated for misconduct. Dan Springer's and that live in Seattle. What exactly is the woman alleging, Dan? Well, Bill, this whistleblower is alleging coercion and corruption in the office of insurance commissioner. Patricia Peterson has been a hearings officer for 28 years, and she's never had much of controversy over her rulings until recently. She claims the deputy insurance commissioner put pressure on her to side with the insurance commissioner, Mike Kreidler. Now, when she didn't get, uh, when she didn't do that, she got a negative job evaluation. It said, "Quote: Since your orders are legally the acts of the commissioner, they must be orders that he supports." Republicans are in Olympia are crying foul. She has to be completely independent. She has to be able to make her decisions, her rulings, based upon law, not upon somebody's desire. But here's a twist. Peterson was not given whistleblower status by the state auditor, who is a Democrat, and is now on paid leave under investigation for leaking her whistleblower complaint to a lawyer involved in the original case. Bill? Uh, how's the Affordable Care Act fit into all of this mess here, Dan? Well, this all centers on the insurance commissioner's desire to bring down the cost of health care, even if it limits choices. And in this case, it has. Seattle Children's Hospital was kept out of the state exchange because the commissioner thinks they charge too much for some services. Children's argues that it's an essential provider and must be in the exchange. Well, the insurance commissioner wanted children's uh, appeal to be denied. Instead, the hospital was granted a hearing by Patricia Peterson. Democrats are rallying behind the insurance commissioner. This employee is not towing his line. He damn well ought to get on her case about it. We would demand that. If we like his policies, we want them carried out effectively by employees. They are employees. Ah, uh, but the insurance commissioner's website seems to contradict that from Senator Klein. It says hearings officers are, quote, impartial judges. Bill? And the case continues. Thank you, Dan. Dan Springer's out there in Seattle. Okay. Appreciate it. 25 minutes past the hour.